Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm be making cute little rusticy wood type picture frames. So I have some wood and I'm gonna tell you what makes me so, so sad right now. My computer completely just stopped working and I rely on that thing Mind you, I don't back anything up because, well, that's just not me to back stuff up. Like, I'll remember that this time. So anyways, this video, I've already done this video, but I planned on making more of these anyways. I've already done this one. I like painted it white with like a little bit of light blue in it to make it a little, anyways. So I already made some of these picture frames and I'll show you those as well. But I am just going to do a couple more to do a video because what I did got erased and deleted and it's all gone now and my heart is hurting so much. I don't think, like, it's just hours and hours and hours of editing that is gone and I am like, I'm so upset. But we're gonna keep positive because like I said, I still have some wood left that I haven't used and I wanted to do it anyways. So I'm just going to make another video with the ones I made today and the ones that I made previously. I'm gonna show you that as well. So I'm gonna get started, I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna use, and these are gonna be so simple and so, so easy to make. And this is everything that's laid out in front of me. So we got paint, brushes, burlap, twine, flowers, everything like that. And I am just gonna start, and I cut a plastic cup in half just so I could use it for my paint, and then I'm just going to throw some paint on this, and it's not gonna be perfect because I want to look at that like rustic-y type farmhousey like paint crappy you know whatever so it's gonna look so distressed and so stinking cute and oh my gosh I'm like super in love with these already and I did not forget any of the sides of these because with my firework video I totally forgot one of them but out of 20 I didn't think that was so bad but this is so easy and the paint dries so fast so it's so quick and easy to do this DIY. And the next I'm just going to take the twine and I'm just going to tie it around the back of it and then I'm going to flip it over and then I am just going to wrap the twine all the way around the bottom so it will hold a photo. And I absolutely love this and I love how it turns out so I had to do it to every single one because it was just too cute not to do. And then I'm just going to give it a little bit of color and just add these cute little wildflowers to it and I purchased these at the dollar store. They're so stinking cute. I wasn't sure how I wanted them but I ended up just like shoving them in there and it worked out perfect. I've been trying my best for and then this little piece of wood was really really tiny but I decided to use just a little oh my gosh what is it called clothes pin and I just painted it white and then I just glued that on there and then added some twine for a while, trying to please everyone who's around me I've been putting on my fake smile even though I'm wasting time I don't want to be trapped in a box trying to be like the rest when I'm not I just want to go my One was really small but I decided to use a wallet size picture for it and then this I actually attempted to make a burlap bow but obviously when I started to do this I realized that was way too stinking big I did actually save that in case I want to use it for something else because it didn't look half bad for a big giant bow I just needed to like put something in the middle but I was like okay way too big so I decided to make this little tiny bow and let me tell you this is the first time I have made a bow and it turned out so cute I just folded the burlap in half and kind of flipped it flipped it to make it look like a bow and then I just tied some twine in the middle and you guys do not realize actually you might how stinking excited I was that this turned out like I was jumping for joy and happiness of how stinking cute this looked I'm gonna leave it all behind find myself I'm gonna start a new so then once that beautiful perfect bow <laughs> was done I just glued it right to the top of this piece of wood and then I took my twine once again and I just tied it to the back and then I just wrapped it around a few times at the bottom and I actually ran out of twine so I didn't have as much as I did with the other ones but it still looked stinking cute yeah. I'm on my way now 
And here is what they look like when they are all done. I am so happy. I absolutely love these. I think they are so cute and so easy to make. my video thank you so much for watching and this is so simple and so quick and so easy and so so inexpensive to do like the wood is free and all they have to do is buy some twine flowers maybe a little bit of burlap so it costs like four dollars to make all these frames so how freaking incredible and how exciting and i think they turned out so stinking cute and that's probably like my favorite diy i've ever done in my whole entire life but okay so that is it if you like videos like this make sure you give it a big old thumbs up and if you're new to my channel i would love you subscribe i make videos every monday wednesday and friday and i'll see you in the next video bye